These are the DE25 and DEP25 wet or dry vacuum dust extractors with automatic switching. They are specifically designed to work in conjunction with our power tools. They're fully compatible with European Union CE, CB, and EMC standards and are waterproof and dustproof to protection class IP44. They can be used to collect dust and chips with our drywall sanders, concrete saws, metal cutting saws, wall chasers, stone grinders, concrete grinders, bush hammer, scouring machine, circular and miter saws, tile core drills, diamond core drills. They also work with our diamond core drill vacuum collector pad and other similar devices. And of course, with the optional accessory set, they can also be used for general cleanup in the workshop or job site. The high output 1200 watt motor has bypass cooling to avoid overheating and has enough reserve suction power to control dust, even in the most challenging power tool applications. Its maximum airflow is 4000 liters per minute, which is 240 cubic meters per hour, and the maximum suction is 25 kPa, which is 250 millibar. The top handle is positioned at the optimal balance point. The large diameter wheels easily roll across worksite debris and irregularities. The rear wheels are lockable. The center position is unlocked and either up or down are locked. In addition to the suction port, there's also a blower port that can be used as a blower for various purposes. The tank has a 25 liter effective capacity. It opens with two quick release clips. It has three layers of filtration. The bag, which is washable cloth with a hook and loop closure, the diaphragm filter, and the pleated main filters. The diaphragm filter includes an electromagnetic shaker, which works automatically to loosen accumulated dust. The liquid overflow switch keeps the tank from being overfilled when wet vacuuming. The suction power control wheel allows you to steplessly tailor the suction to various applications and tools. On the DE25, the main switch can be set to manual for a constant running or to auto for integrated switching. Under this spring-loaded cover is the integrated switching socket. You plug your power tool into the socket and when you trigger the tool, the vacuum automatically switches on. You can connect any power tool up to 2200 watts and when you turn off the tool, the vacuum automatically continues to run for a few seconds to clear dust from the hose. And the DEP25 pneumatic switching model, in addition to the manual and electric integrated switching of the DE25, there is also integrated switching triggered by your air tool. Just connect the air tool in series and switch to auto air and it operates in the same way as the electrical integrated switching. The minimum pressure is 3 bar or 44 psi. Standard equipment includes a 4 meter vacuum hose including hose end adapter, the pair of pleated main filters, washable diaphragm filter, and a washable cloth dust bag with hook and loop closure. Optional equipment includes disposable paper dust bags for dry use, foam main filters for wet vacuuming which take the place of the pleated dry filters, spare hose end adapters for connecting to a tool, accessory set, handle, telescopic tube, floor nozzle, round brush, and crevice nozzle. To mount the dust bag, release the two clips to open the tank cover and lift away. Lift out the diaphragm filter. Open the bag. Don't mount it collapsed or folded. Remove the cap and mount the neck securely. To replace the main filters or to switch to wet use main filters, press the catch on the filter frame to release. Engage the tangs and snap in place. Ensure that it makes a good seal. If suction power decreases noticeably, the bag will need to be emptied. Dispose of the dust in an approved fashion. After emptying, the cloth dust bag and diaphragm filter are washable with water. Allow them to dry fully before operating, otherwise the wet material will cake with dust. Pleated main filters are not washable, but they can be removed and dust shaken out.
for wet vacuuming, switch to the wet use main filters and do not use the dust bag. The overflow will switch off the motor when the tank is full. The rubber power tool connector is possible to fit a number of different sizes of tool dust port. It can also be cut down to fit a larger size of dust port. After cutting, save the cut piece so that you can sleeve it back down to a smaller size if necessary. To operate, turn the machine on by switching the main switch to manual and adjust the suction power control wheel to the desired setting. And switch the main switch to auto AC. It will then switch on automatically when the power tool is triggered. When the power tool is switched off, the vacuum will shut off after a few seconds. Integrated switching with a pneumatic tool operates in a similar fashion.